Pointing your GoDaddy.com domain name uh, to WP Engine can be as simple as editing the DNS settings for your domain name and pointing this primary A record, which is represented by this at symbol, to WP Engine's IP address. So you can grab this IP address from here, copy, paste, and you're all set. However, if WP Engine updates or changes the IP address that you're pointing to, you need to coordinate with their change in the future, and this can catch you off guard, which can be a pain. Instead, here's a better approach for pointing your domain name to WP Engine. Copy this, uh, this C name, which is your install name, .wpengine.com. Jump over to edit these DNS settings for your domain name. And let's scroll on down to the C name, which is an alias record. Find the www and edit this to point to your install.wpengine.com. Finish, save changes. And what we've done essentially is uh, told the www.yourdomain.com to go to WP Engine. Great. However, if the user enters the root, yourdomain.com, without the www, it's still using this primary A record. To resolve this issue, let's jump over to Settings, Manage Forwarding. Let's add a new forward, and we're going to forward the primary domain to www. And in this case, I'm using Inkfront as the example domain for this video. That's it. Leave this as a 301 permanent redirect. Forward only is fine. And update the name servers and DNS settings to support this change. Click Add. Save that change. And you'll see in a few minutes, uh, if we go back to this DNS settings, the primary A record IP address will default back to GoDaddy's IP. And this forward here, let's uh, refresh this page to see if it shows up. There we go, the root inkfront.com domain will forward to its www format, which will point to this CNAME record, which passes the domain on to WP Engine. Um, as long as you've got your domain name here at WP Engine, and let's make sure that we're using the www. That's it. You should be all set.